Hello everybody, Eminent Storm here, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 3. In our last episode, we decided to take a bit of a different approach to our uh, efforts in South America, over here. I mean, we're pushing through Brazil, trying to see if we could you know, get Brazil's victory points, but we ran into a wall of enemy units. So what we've tried, decided to do is instead, well, we'll keep these forces here, but then bring in another a uh, set of armies over here and we attacked Venezuela we brought Venezuela into the Axis as a puppet and we are now pushing into Colombia trying to you know make Colombia puppet then Peru then Bolivia and then swing in through here and come in around behind them and hopefully this will help eliminate a lot of the allied forces that are holding me up here because we'll make them puppets and then you know they won't be fighting me anymore um so we're gonna be continuing with that um and i've also thought about it and decided i want to start bringing in some more armies and start pushing up um central america here through panama um costa rica nicaragua honduras el salvador and guatemala all right um, but I'm going to need some more armies for that, which we have. Um, I have an entire army sitting right here that's ready to go. Um, we'll probably bring those over. Um, we have this entire army here, which is, you know, our mountain infantry and our super heavy tanks and our heavy tanks. Um, uh, not this guy, though. I think that guy needs to go over there. Because he isn't attached to anything. So. What I might do is bring these guys over here. Now, this stack right here is um, our new divisions. A lot of our new divisions. Armored and mechanized infantry that we were kind of just mass producing. Um, but we ran out of leaders. So not all of these units have leaders. And pretty much this entire stack here of unorganized units which is at least another army um again has no leaders so i have to go in at some point and add those leaders in uh, manually um which i just haven't had time to do that before i recorded today so um these two stacks are kind of not very useful yet until i get those leaders in but these two armies should be enough to get things started um, oh yeah, these divisions. And actually, what we probably want to do is, is that's another stack of units. Um, we just need to get those paratroopers back. So where are those paratroopers? There they are. Okay. We can bring them back, merge them back up with those units I detached from them, and then that's another core of, of forces that we can bring in. Alright, so... What we're going to do is, actually, this guy... I'm going to port him up here. Um... These are marine cores. Those are the cores. Um, where are the passenger ships? Okay. Let's rebase that guy over there. Let's let's get things moving here. So another thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take these armies. Actually, I'm. I don't want to necessarily bring them in there. I want to bring them here. I want to get them ready to move, to get brought in. Oh, yeah, all those things. Redirect my manpower. We have 3,900, so we can send 1,000 manpower somewhere. We're going to do better research. And I'm going to bring those guys and I'm going to invade... Panama and try and take the uh, 
Panama Canal. That will hamper the mobility of the American Navy. Alright, so you guys... Transport them over there. And these passenger ships... Send them that way. And you guys, actually, can head this way as well. Get ready to pick those, uh, those guys up. Alright, so... Those guys moving like that. These Marines are moving in. So where is the victory points? Here and here. Okay, so. Let's send two divisions here. One division. No, oh, no, oh, no. Oh. Two divisions this way, one division that way. These guys are just moving. Straight down there. Next, I'm going to attack you with one of my divisions. My bombers. There are my bombers. Uh, let's let's see who has the better air base. Neither of these guys do. This is a good air base. Let's rebase them there. And then bring them in to no 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 no, no. cancel cancel. Uh, don't want to drop the nuke. Ooh, okay, ground attack. That's what we want to do. Okay, so let's send a contingent of these guys this way. battle. Good. Let's send that guy that way. We're gonna need... Battle of Carvelis. Yeah, we're gonna keep that, that fleet there. Being port struck in Curacao. Uh, they hit the the Urla there, but no big deal. And I do need to get in and, at some point and spend some time and rename a bunch of these ships. Let's see, can we attack this guy and make any headway there? The heavy fighters... Can we ground attack that guy? Up 
They're trying to bomb me. I'll throw that guy in. I march that guy to sit there and hold that province in Panama so that we don't get flanked. Yeah, we enforce Puppet on Columbia. Perfect. Hey, and there's Ecuador. Okay, so... Uh, let's see... Columbia's mobilizing. Well, they better. Oh, uh, we lost the effect of Puppet Master? Okay, so, we need to move... our guys into uh, Ecuador here. Or at least along the border. Oh, can't move there. Let's see. Yeah. No infrastructure. So let's just get everybody moving. Let me see. Let's strategically redeploy a lot of these guys. Um, to the border. All right, so get those guys moving through Colombia. Uh, Peru may take out Ecuador again, but that's okay. All right, we got some more stuff here and another super heavy armor division. Drop it there. All right, so we got our guys here. Let's merge them up temporarily, and I gotta remember to split them up again before we try to launch an invasion. Let's load this army up. And let's bring them back here. Yep, and there's all of the uh, Colombian units then dropping out of their their formations and joining my forces. Peru is up next. Tracing tactics, cruiser warfare, all right, good. All right, where are you guys? Okay. One thing I also want to do, once, um, how do you not have supplies? How are we not getting supplies in a Santa Domingo? There's 13 ships. And there's tons of supplies in that province. Eh, maybe just a, a hiccup.
They're still hitting me really heavy here. And actually, what I might do is take just some of these guys and retreat them out. There's no real reason for them to, to be in there right now. Alright, you guys uh, redeploy here. You guys do a strategic redeploy here. Yeah, let's get everybody into position. And actually, what might be a better idea is to move these guys this way, get them into the Colombian supply network. Because of the way things work, they can't get supplied here, but they can get supplied in these two provinces here. So, until I get a port, which I don't have a port yet. Which one of these is... No, advanced Education Investment, okay. Jet Engine Advance, good. Alright, looks like our guys have arrived. So, what we want to do is we need to split this up. Take these passenger ships out. Let's load up the assault ships. What we do is we drop all of the cores. We'll come back and get them later. Oh, always do that. So, who are we going to leave behind? I guess we'll drop the mechanized infantry out of here for now. There we go. That gives me enough weight. Oh, oh, we're going to take the theater command out. We don't want that. Alright, let's load them up. Let's do an invasion here. Bring this fleet over to provide shore bombardment. Big jet engine advance. And under attack from Peru. Oh, we're actually doing our landing in Panama. Bam! Aha! Alright, so you guys go back. So, change of plans. You guys attack. And you guys support. And we need to get some supplies into the Panama Canal, Cologne, there. Um, so, we need somewhere where there's a good pile of supplies lying around. No supplies in Constanta.
Actually, either one of these should work. Um, there's not a ton of fuel, but it's something. So let's let's do that one. Uh, that guy, and we're gonna go to there. And we got five, five convoys. There we go. Alright, so you guys, once you're done taking that, uh, swing around down here. Actually, just, just push it in there and then we're going to redeploy you down south. Um, these guys are just going to launch an attack this way. Oh, I don't think we actually set up a war goal on Panama. Um, I'm going to conquer Panama because I want to control the territory. Because all these little countries are going to make the supplies goofy. Um, unless I actually control the territory. And once we move beyond them and we're like, we're fighting up here or something, then I can release these, um, these guys back here off as puppets. Alright. We just annex Panama. Perfect. Alright, everybody move that way. Alright, so these guys move this way. Um, these guys need to get back down here. Um, no, we're going to save our money on that. You guys can move that way, provide fire support. You're getting, uh... Naval struck. Ow, that hurt. Uh, never mind. You guys rebase back. Okay. At least they they were there for the initial landing, so that's okay. All right, you guys. Um, keep them at the front. And warriors need their hull. Alright, so, how do we want to advance here? What does infrastructure look like? We can't move through here, so this stack is going to swing this way. And we have... These guys are going to swing here, these guys are going to march this way. Yep, that should work. Whoa, okay, um... High popularity... Carry group doctrine... Bombs are falling on us in... David? Wow, that is a lot... of aircraft... Who is this? Nicaragua. Alright, we're just gonna put Conquer on... We're gonna put Conquer on all these guys. And Honduras. And we'll go Conquer. They're attacking me here. That's fine. The ground attacked me pretty good there. Alright, where is their victory point? Here? Alright, you guys just swing there. Okay. 
Okay. These guys are all reorganized. They can come back to the front. Perfect. Alright, so yep. Yeah. These, this here is now all plains, so we're, we're getting out of the jungle areas, though there is still some jungle over here. Um, the mountains are going to be interesting through here. Uh, actually, I might want to send... Um, Another supply convoy from Alanya to Panama. Uh, battle, battle, uh, under attack, defense in depth, battle of Manta. All right, good. So we should uh, get conquer on uh, Costa Rica here in a moment. Yep. Conquer on Costa Rica. Get those guys in position. Once we get this set of ports here, then we can release Panama and Costa Rica as puppets. Alright, so we won that battle there. So let's actually push in here. What does the uh, infrastructure look like? Okay, we'll push oh. like that. Super heavy armor, okay. We need to drop that here. There we go. Okay, so you guys move here, you guys move there. You guys continue on that way. And actually, I'll just continue to push... ...like this. The commando units advance. What I really need to do is take... Take Mexico out of the fight. Once we hit the Mexican border... Is when I'm going to go and I'm going to grab... Um, grab this this stack to assist that's when we'll need the additional units uh oh there was one other thing I wanted to do one other oh mechanized infantry plus the the cores uh you guys need to load up and get transported here. Um, where is my invasion fleet? There we are. So what I wanted to do is... Um, let's see, take a few divisions here, like three divisions. Let's create a commando unit. Let's 
place in the build queue. Yay, typos. Ooh, we have our jet fighters under construction now. I have a commando battalion. Eh, we might as well. Not sure what we'll do with that. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab... Supply Transportation Organization, we take those off. They're bombing pretty good, but all of my units basically have... Um, any aircraft guns in them, so... Ooh, that's a really nice port. Um, so let's do this. Alanya, there. Cancel that convoy and recreate it. To here. 16 convoys. That is what... I like there. Okay, close it. It can send 49.35 units of supplies. Oh, those little stupid attacks. Alright, you guys. Move that way. And actually move all the way here. Not control. Shift. Shift. There we go. Alright, so you, mechanized infantry, slide to the front, like that, so. Is this in you over there? Peruvian convoy escort. Yep. Uh, let's see what we got. More mechanized infantry. Okay, so those units that I moved here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to load them up. I'm going to do an amphibious invasion of Bermuda. Actually, let's bring these ships here because I know that they can get repaired there. Fields? Here, okay. Is this. Uh, that's jungle, okay, so that's gonna slow me down a little bit. Okay, so let's, let's do this with those units. Alright, so. Let's 
Let's continue moving. Where is Peru's victory points? Okay, there's one here, one here. And this is American. Alright, so we need to take that. Ooh, and Germany's occupying the Galapagos. Okay. Alright, so... Uh, looks like they do have some defenders there. So, let me grab this fleet. Let's separate off the ships that need repairs. There's 40%, 40%. Those two destroyers. The rest should be okay. Let's move them up there to provide some... Uh, some cover. Especially if they decide to send the Navy over that way. They'll need some protection. Uh, just like that. I lost an assault ship. Should be alright. Just one assault ship. Alright, so now we got some units on Bermuda. And we've taken it back for England. Right, you guys now get back down here. Okay, so we are now moving into Nicaragua's only victory point. So we should take Nicaragua out here so soon. And I think if we move these guys here, we can probably just go ahead and release Panama as a puppet. So let's go ahead and do that. Panama and release them as a puppet. Oops, then back to AI control. There we go. Split these guys up. Okay. Enforce conquer on Nicaragua. All right. Convoy escorts and a transport ship. Okay, there's a Mexican fleet right there. How are you guys looking? Uh, a little dinged, but not too bad. Alright. Next on the menu here is Honduras and El Salvador. So, where are their victory points? Right here. So, you guys just march like this. And these guys just march like this.
Piece of cake. Let's see, that's not that great of a port. Hopefully one of these is going to be a good port. So then I can then move the supplies from San Jose here up forward. And then um, release Costa Rica. Ah, so those are some actual American... Well, actually, that's Canadian troops under American command fighting me in Brazil. You guys can actually go back to the front. These guys are fully... Right, those guys are fully organized. They're just going to hold their ground there. And we're just going to swing through here. Through here. Through here. And come in. And come up behind them. And take them down. I'm hoping... that this army should be sufficient for that task. Just strategically redeploy them. All these guys can move there. And these guys can actually attack here. Oh, what did I click on? Alright, so we conquered Honduras. Oh, that's a decent port right there. So, let's move. Supplies coming into Cologne. From Antalya there. The convoy. To there. Seven convoys. Good. Alright, we'll take down El Salvador here, and then we'll call it a day. We'll call it an episode. Actually, I'm going to strategically redeploy them there, get them in position. We'll get, get these guys up here. Oh yeah, that guy. Actually, you know what I'm going to do with him? I'm just going to strategically redeploy him back here. We haven't had any revolts over there, so I'm not that worried about it anymore. I'm hoping that's the bulk of the Mexican army. So, speaking of that, let's get these two navies, the assault ships, and the troop transports. We're going to head them back to uh, Istanbul to get ready to pick up the next load of troops that's going to come over here to help me knock down Mexico. Which shouldn't be too hard. Then we'll have to establish a defensive line here against the Americans. So probably like right across... Right across here. And then we're going to need to bring over as many forces as we can to set up a line to get ready to start pushing into the southern United States.
So, you guys merge up. Head over here. How's El Salvador going? What I'll probably do is once we take El Salvador, set up the supply route into here. Maybe we'll set up a supply route in here as well. Um, we'll then release uh, Costa Rica. guys actually need to move in here because that's the only province that has any um, infrastructure in it at all and then we're gonna push down through here and grab their victory points here Nima and there and then we'll we'll take Bolivia because Bolivia will fall really easy and then we will push um, I might have to actually conquer Peru. Hmm, not sure. Right, well, let's just speed this up, get this guy moved in. battles out of the way. Oh, some research done. Alright, we are in. Just need to get the data tick over. And we enforce Conquer on El Salvador. And actually, that is not a bad port right there. So, all right. With that, we're going to go ahead and end this episode. So when we come back, we're going to continue our push uh, into uh, Guatemala here. And then into Mexico. And we'll see what we can do here in Brazil. Try to bring as much of South America into the Axis as we possibly can. Alright, so, hope you guys enjoyed it, thanks for watching, go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.